To make the play dough, you'll need a big bowl for mixing in and a spoon, one cup of flour, half a cup of salt, one cup of water, and two spoons of oil. You'll also need paint to make it change colour. So we're going to make play dough so that we can put some rangoli patterns in the top. Now to make our play dough, we need a big bowl. Ready for mixing in. We're going to use our flour. We've got one cup of flour, so to bit in. Next, we've got half a cup of salt. And we're going to stir those two together. Once we've done that, we're going to add two tablespoons of oil. Now this is just cooking oil or vegetable oil, whatever you want to use. One. Two. Now I'm adding paint to make my Play-Doh colourful, but you can use food colouring. One squirt of paint or a couple of drops of food colouring. Stir all that in. Next we're going to add your water. So add the water a little bit at a time until all of your dough comes together. Once your dough starts to stick to your spoon like this in clumps, you can start using your hands. You want to mix all the flour in off the sides of the bowl and make it all one big clump. Once it's ready, you can start squishing it into bowls and then we're going to flatten them out. Now that you've made your play dough, you're going to want to make a little shape like this, a little round disc. Make sure it's nice and flat on the top because that's where we're going to put our pattern. We're going to use whatever you've got around the house. So I've got beads and rice. You're going to make a pattern in the top of your dough by pressing the beads in, one at a time. These patterns are called Rangoli patterns. And traditionally, they use spirals or flowers, but you can choose whatever you like. Keep going until you fill all of the door and make sure to take a picture once you've finished.